Hi, I'm Serena Martin of Serena Martin Design, and I am a Washington, D.C. based artist specializing in watercolor and out gouache. <laughs> started my business all based on commission art and I think you're right knowing that there is a recipient on the other end and creating it for someone it becomes like an act of service rather than just pure creation and I think that combination makes my work really fulfilling. My mission statement is encouraging one another to live relationally through like love and generosity and hoping you know as a result to you know, make a better place together in this world. And I think it's that relational living and the commissioned art relationship process that really, I think, makes my art very special to me because, like you said, it's creating with someone in mind and creating with the end goal of bringing their vision to life is what I think I enjoy the most. I just look at how my business has grown and it's all through trust and relationships and people having faith that I'm able to produce their vision. So like for example, I met Chris through, I mean, I met Riley through another illustrator in DC named Chris. And most people think like we would be competitors because we do a lot of the same things, but I see them as allies um, because I met Chris through Instagram because I thought she was phenomenal and she introduced me to Riley because she thought Riley was phenomenal and as a result I got to know Riley on a personal level and we refer a lot of work to you know to each other especially if we don't feel like we're able to execute to the level that you know our clients expecting. Well that's how I met you. Exactly. <laughs> right. So Riley introduced me to you and I got the opportunity to create something for, you know, Georgetown University, with, which is very, I mean, it's a huge honor. And then getting to know you on this level and introducing you to Mimi, and it's like a network of people. And without those relationships, I don't think I would have a business. Number one, like, don't be afraid. I think most of the fear is in our own heads. And sometimes by just taking that first step is the best way to conquer it. Um, and never discount hard work. I think starting out, I just didn't realize how much time it would take. And as a result, I find the harder you work, the more lucky you get. So yeah, don't be afraid and just keep at it. And it, it's time. It's just like eventually time will pay, pay off. So good luck. <laughs>